I'll just show you how we can add this as an image. So you can see I've just dragged that down into the storyboard. Now, over on the right hand side, See how it has a plus and minus? That is going to stretch this bottom half out or in. So when you are editing, it is easier to stretch it out if there are specific gaps or things that you really need to look at a little bit more closely. Now, if we go find okay, where I put that image, so it is here. We can see it here. It's on its own separate line. So once we are highlighted in this section with this white playhead, we can now pick this up. We can make it small. We can make it bigger. We can move it anywhere we like. So if there was something that you were mentioning in a video and then you wanted it to flash up, you could do it like that. So when you are creating a video, it's not just video. You can add images as inside the video itself. So it's on the screen. If we move that, so you can see it. So then when you play, hang on, just be quiet. So you'll see that's how long it pops up for as long as this length of time is. And just like in a video, you can stretch it out. So if you want that image there for the whole length of the video, you can. Or if you just wanted it as a little pop-up, you could as well. See, because what you could do, if you're putting your hand up, like clearly I do a lot in this video for some reason, I could move this and I'm just drag and dropping this to this section, right? And I could make it that it pops up in my hand. So when the hand comes up, you could do it like that. So there's many different ways you can add an image. It's, it's not just a video.